Alrighty, welcome back. We are officially back where we left off. So we are going here. Hell of an office one. Danny, back for more chaos. I'm playing like like really early today, so <laughs> I feel like I'm getting a glare from my on my monitor. Alright. Make sure I'm going to collect everything, you know? Alright. Let me just use the... the... bench real quick. Cause I, I do wanna... Add a suppressor to one of them. Oh, we did get this new, uh, weapon. So let me... Mod laser. Fast reload, that's cool. Give it that charm. Um, let me just... I guess I'm gonna put it here. We still need some, uh... Parts and stuff. I uh, gotta, like, remember how to uh, get those. That's what the suppressor on this. I just need one. Alright, uh, ride weapon. We don't have anything for that. No. Favorite guerrilla. All right. I think we just can just do the so next mission. Fun ways to fuck up soldados. All right, let's do this. Want me to make you the best supremos and resolver weapons? You need depleted uranium. Lucky for you, Castillo has stashed his supply with the biggest guns on the island, his anti-aircraft cannons. When you got some of that sweet uranium, you can bring it back to my office, or to one of my associates. If you capture an FND base, a member of Team Juan will move in and give you access to my inventory. And don't forget, rank has its privileges. When Clara is kind enough to promote you, we'll be able to hook you up with better gear. Just have those pesos ready. Even in revolution, nothing comes free. And here's some advice, guerrilla to guerrilla. Have some fun for fuck's sake. Die with a smile on your face. All right. Do they, want to... they always come back. Check what one has in store. Okay, so I can buy these. Revolver weapon. I mean, I don't know. I mean, EMP pulse, knock over enemies, disable security. Oh, that sounds good. I think we're gonna buy this, I guess. I mean, I guess we can buy. This one has good damage. I guess I'll buy that. All right, let's equip it. Uh, arsenal. That one looks really cool. I want to see how it works. All right, we did get uh, another weapon. Let's check that out. Um, resolve our weapon. So like, I'm guessing these are like special weapons. Not really sure how this works. Oh, I think it's like a bow, like a crossbow. All right. Let's talk to Clara. Over here. This is a pretty small island, right? Yeah, it is. I really want to explore some of the places with you guys. Maybe if I finish the game, I can do that. Possibly. A fire somewhere. Can't really jump for some reason. Yo, look at my boy go up. Look at him. Look at him. 
Hey there, man. Gulp was just chill. Who is this? I don't know who that is. Uh, let's go talk to her. No more horsing around. Once you're back at Santuario, shake the trees for guns, ammo, new believers. Cause was surprised. Let's keep it that way. Welcome to Libertad, Danny. I can leave any time. What's the rush? Inspiring. Let's free Yara, shall we? Castile controls all of Yara with soldados, slaves, and blood. The capital is a stronghold. We take Esperanza, we free Yara. Best chance we got to weaken Castillo is to hit military targets like FND bases and checkpoints. But most important, we have to surround Esperanza and trap Castillo in his cage. That means targeted operations that will unite the revolution and make Libertad stronger. To do that, I need you to recruit three groups in Yara to fight with Libertad. Each is waging war across Yara with a different piece of Castillo's empire, all controlled by his inner circle. In El Este, foreign invaders like Mickey Industries suck our resources dry, and Admiral Benitez defends Castillo's poison lifeline. But the old legends of 67 can help us turn the tide. They're hiding in the jungles of the highest mountains of Yara. Their greatest guerrilla, El Tigre, is waiting with open arms to help you bring them on our side. Then we have Valle de Oro. Not just the engine of Castillo's Viviro operation, but also his propaganda machine, run by his Minister of Culture, Maria Marquesa. But I have some old friends who can run our counter-propaganda campaign, Maximas Matanzas. They were the voice of the protests and can mobilize Yara's dissidents to fight for Libertad. They've gone dark. Last seen at a fort in Balaceras. We need to find them before Castillo's forces do. In Madrugada, we have Castillo's nephew, Jose, a slave driver who forces outcasts to grow that poison Viviro tobacco. But the Montero family is waging war against Jose. They hate visitors, but I have intel on a mechanic who has a workshop in Costa del Mar. His name is Fili Barzaga, and he's their gatekeeper. If I were you, Danny, I'd start in Madrugada. We take back that tobacco with the Montero's help, and we got Castillo's Viviro at the source. You just need to find this mechanic, Philly. I'll be here actioning targeted Libertad strikes against Castillo throughout Yara. Hang on. I'm going to get all these groups to sign up to Libertad by myself? How? Simple. You help. Any way you can. I send a squad to these groups, I'm an invader. I send a scout, then I'm not serious. With you? They get my best career without politics and bullshit. Just help. Libertad takes the capital, we slit Anton's throat, maybe drink his blood, etc., etc. Then he needs a walk. You are Libertad, Fa. Yeah, yeah. I'm not Clara's best career. You are. You're not listening. Translate what? The accent. Clara hides it best she can, but she was born rich. From a family of true Yaren she left behind. She can shoot, bleed, drink with us all she wants, but she can't hide the stink of the upper class. What's that have to do with me? You are an orphan, Danny. Poor, from the dirt. When they see you, they don't see politics. They see they have no excuse. She's using me. See? And you're using her right back. Do you want to kill Anton? See? Do you want to free Yara? Sure you do. But here's what Clara can't say, but you and I both know. You want this. You're a guerrilla. And for a guerrilla, the shit my pants rush of an ambush, the smell of sulfur burning your nostrils, it's... It's... It's fun. Don't worry. Your secret is safe with me. Right, so we're basically just recruiting these uh, these groups. 
So I definitely heard like you can like uh, switch like your amigos. I definitely want to get Chorizo. He's basically like the dog. Uh, maybe in the next few parts I might do that. I'm not sure quite yet. Okay. So it seems like we have to go on boat. So we just call the boat. I think it's this over here. Extra content, all your extra purchase content is now yours. Visit our. I mean, I don't have anything, so. Alright, let's do this. I don't know if. The oh, fuck, there you go. He's right there. I don't know if he can come on the boat too or what, but. I don't know. We definitely have to leave him, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> this is so beautiful. I don't even feel like this is the part where you could basically just explore everything. <laughs> Look at all this, holy shit. It's like a whole ocean. Daddy, listen to one. You kill soldiers, Castillo's going to send his special forces after you. Know what makes them so special? They're specially trained and heavily armed. I definitely wish we can go in third person, but it doesn't seem like we can do that. Make contact with Philly. Hopefully this isn't too hard. Let's see what it looks like when behind. I always love going in boats. Usually I go uh, boat riding with my dad. Basically like go fishing and stuff. So. It kind of gives me that vibe. Clara, who am I looking for in Madrugada again? You want Carlos Montero, the leader of a group of farmers trying to take back their land from the army. But he'll never meet with you. Why not? He's what you would call old school. Doesn't like outsiders and doesn't trust anyone except family. Great. Don't worry. Philly can help you. He's your in. He's at his shop near the Martinez airstrip. Ah, uh, nothing comes easy. Nothing worth fighting for. Suerte, Danny. Dude, yeah, I already feel like I'm gonna crash this boat. <laughs> it feels just like that. Hunting spot. I don't know, I don't know if I wanna go hunting just yet. Getting, oh no, fuck. That's super cool. I think I'm just gonna. I think we might have to just leave the boat here. Alright. Alright, let's do this. Hopefully, it's not too tough. It's my car coming. I mean, I'm, I'm assuming you have to go on foot, but I'm not sure. So this feels unrestricted. Oh, this feels unrestricted. <laughs> Sorry. Some bunch of crap everywhere. This place is colorful. Let's take everything while we're at it. <laughs> Are you Philly? I'm Danny. No, 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 Philly here. Whoa, what's in your bag? Know what I can find him. Cerves?
So who's in charge? Everything got another purpose. And you come here for a second. Did you just come here? And you hold that down for me. That's a dead man switch. One move. So, why are you here? I'm with Clara from Libertad. Didn't she say I was coming? Clara, Libertad. Oh, look so at so Chorizo. <laughs> but I don't see Clara. I only see you. So why are you here? Got family to save? Got kids? No. So what do you want out of this? I want my finger off this switch. And I want to know who's going to help me take down Castillo. Okay. You're safe now. <laughs> so you're Clara's hero, huh? I'm no hero. Oh, <laughs> God. It's going to share me. Philip Magic, baby. Want us to help you, Berta? You need Carlos Montero, our backbone. His family is gonna save our land. Yeah, I thought that was like a bug at first, no, 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 or a no, glitch. No, no, no. Step one, Philly needs to love you. Step two, baby Montero needs to love you. Baby Montero? <laughs> See that? Chorizo, come on, let's go back. That's Bala, his daughter. You know, last time I heard, she went to hit that outcast plantation east of here. She likes you. You're in. A good luck finding her. La Espada. Oh, man. She's a fiera. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Next time I see you, I want to play with that crazy backpack, dear. No. Well, then don't let the poison get you down. <laughs> Fucking comedian. I'm not gonna lie, that dude seemed like an asshole. <laughs> Alright. What is this? So there's probably like alligators or crocodiles over there. Alright, um... Can I still call my car from over here? I'm not really sure. There is a horse over here, so I'm just gonna take the horse. I guess not. Oh, there is. Oh, never mind. Oh, I could change his color. Looks really cool with this. Can change with this. Instant horse. Go! Uh, I'm just gonna set a waypoint real quick. There you go. <laughs> I don't think it really worked. <laughs> 